Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video here on Akuma MC Prisons and in this video we're just going to be trying to max out our pickaxe and level it up a ton so stay tuned to the very end. Alright, so in this video we are actually going to be trying to max out our pickaxe or not max it out but just level it up a ton where it's going to help us mine and basically for the tokens and chance and stuff like that we can only have maxed out token miner maxed out gold mine maxed out bolt we just have all of these pretty decent low level enchants maxed out except for jack hammer jack hammer is one that does cost a lot as you do level it up but we do we still need to level up our pickaxe for some more enchants like key finder xp finder and token merchant we are really really needing token merchant so i think our main goal is to get to level 30 for our pickaxe but we're gonna keep mining we do currently have this tier 2 pouch which is gonna give us some tokens once we do unlock it and we're just gonna be doing that we do have this drill bit pet which is giving us some token boost which we're definitely going to take we do have two trill tokens and hopefully we get some more crates and stuff like that just so we can get a good amount of tokens that we can or a good amount of crates that we can get from the tokens that we can then use on our pickaxe but yeah we're trying to continue mining we're honestly really just looking forward to actually getting our pickaxe leveled up and we do also want to rank up because our mine is pretty small right now it's not that efficient like we can only go in like a few circles so yeah we're gonna try to get that uh we're gonna try to get the mine leveled up too uh that's probably gonna be one of the main goals throughout every episode because it is currently really small and it is just very very inefficient as you can see, like, once it is bigger, we just go, like, straight lines and stuff, but we have to just keep going in circles, which is kind of inefficient, and we did get a milestone, so let's go ahead and claim some of these milestones. They do give you some tokens and stuff, so we do have a lot of those. That's going to give me around 12 tokens. We do have some of these vaults and stuff, and all of these, which aren't that much, but as you do keep progressing on these milestones, you do get better and better rewards. Let's go ahead and open up these crates. I'm going to save these caches for a little bit later, once we do get a little bit more stuff like that. So, yeah, we're going to save those. We got two common grenades. Um, They're not the best so let's just go ahead and throw them down and i mean i'm just gonna throw down the grenade because we do want the mine to reset because honestly there's not that much we can mine in this small mine so that's why we're trying to level up and try to get a pretty good pickaxe as fast as we can so let's see what pickaxe level we're at we're at 14 so we are actually leveling up pretty fast we should be able to get it to level 30 in a little bit it shouldn't take too long to grind out currently we just gonna go we just gotta start farming because grinding is honestly the only way that we're gonna be able to level up pretty fast we also did get the rank milestone upgrade so let's take that i'm pretty sure the rank milestones give you things like crates and stuff yeah boom as you can see we are rank 50 right now and every 20 levels you do get a mine size increase so once we get to level 60 the mine will actually increase a little bit and that's basically just how you get a bigger mine is by keep farming and ranking up one of the best ways to start getting tokens as a beginner is they do some key alls every now and then if you take a look at their discord they will post it in the events channel i'm pretty sure but yeah they do some do they do some crates alls which you can get some good crates from it and basically with those crates they can give you some tokens and like as you can see this one these token packages the best one is 750 bill but for the relics or uh, the other ones i forgot they're called i'm pretty sure they're vaults they actually do give a little bit more tokens so those are honestly really good to get some beginner tokens and you get those from the crates i don't think we have too many crates let me go check yeah we have a few so we're just gonna hold off on those we don't have too much to really do anything with but we do have these common armor boxes that we don't even need we're basically with the common arm boxes and just basically the common stuff that are going to give us some bad rarities we basically just salvage those for some extra salvage points that we can then go ahead and buy some mythical armor boxes with and with the mythical armor boxes we could then go ahead and get some mythical and hopefully masterful pieces masterful is the best rarity here on the server and as you can see it goes for the pets too we only have rare pet right now but as we do keep progressing and getting better stuff we are going to go ahead and go for these masterful rarity items and those are just going to help us a ton one way that could help us uh, level up our pickaxe a little bit faster is with the booster xps or i'm pretty sure the pickaxe xp booster that can actually double the amount of XP we're getting for a pickaxe, which could actually help us. But we currently don't have any of those. The only way I currently know of getting them is probably buying them off of players or getting them from crates. In the previous videos, I've gotten them from crates. And those were some pretty good crates, so it is going to be kind of difficult to get those. But they're definitely worth it. And we did get to rank 60, so our mine should have increased a little bit, and it did. It's not a major difference, but once you do get to the higher ranks, you're definitely going to notice the difference that it does make. And I don't really know if like level 100 or rank 100 and stuff like that gives you a little bit more expansion probably because because once I was like a pretty high level, it was a pretty big mine. So and once we do get our pickaxe a little bit higher, like enchants and stuff like that, we are going to go ahead and get the prestige finder enchant, which will just give us some more gems. And with the gems, we can go ahead and buy the multiplier finder and just all of these pretty good gem enchants. And basically, multiplier finder just gives us more money, and money is used to prestige. And it's honestly just like prestige is just automatically happen so that was a pretty good enchant that's gonna help you prestige and then you could eventually 
um, rebirth or something like that. And yeah, so it's honestly good. Okay, so I got another one of these pouches. I think I'm going to wait until I get this, and I'm just going to open both of them once I do. I think I only have 1k more blocks, which is kind of like nothing. 1k blocks is really, really easy to mine. So we're going to go ahead and mine those and unlock it, and then I'm going to open them at the same time. It's going to give us a decent amount of tokens, and then I'm also going to open some crates for a little bit of extra tokens. And then after that, we're just going to use all our tokens to go ahead and chain my pickaxe, and hopefully we can get some pretty good enchants on it, and hopefully we are a pretty decent level. I kind of want to get to level 30, for that token merchant which is just going to give us more tokens and yeah we are honestly just looking to expand our mind that's honestly the main goal but we just need to rank up for that i mean currently we are progressing at a pretty good rate we're already almost rank 70 i'm pretty sure we started this video at rank 50 so we are ranking up pretty fast and we are almost at pickaxe like we're pickaxe level 23 which is not terrible we're kind of close to actually getting to 30 we just have to grind a little bit more and boom rank 70 once we do get to rank 80 our mind should expand a little bit more and i'm pretty sure once we do get to rank 100 it might give us a chance to do like ornaments and basically ornaments just help your pickaxe i don't think they're here but they basically can give you token boost and enchant prog boost stuff like that so they're honestly really really good and i'm pretty sure you get them every like 100 or 200 levels so make sure to watch out for those once you are approaching to that level 100 mark but we do currently have both of the pouches unlocked so let's go ahead and claim both of them i'm going to start off with the tier 2 and boom that's 5 tro tokens there and then the tier 3 is 7.5 tro that's not bad let's go to spawn i want to go ahead and open up some crates go ahead and open up these five earthen crates so we could get a few trillion tokens from that and let's go to the slash crates i'm pretty sure these alone can give you some of the tokens so like let me check yeah you get some tokens there but let's go ahead and open up them i'm just going to spam open all of them and okay looks like we've opened up all of them and we do have around 41 trill tokens we'll definitely take that we do have some more caches and stuff like that and some vaults so we're going to open up those two and we basically salvage the ranks and uncommon stuff that we don't really need so i'm going to go ahead and open up these keep open up these caches and vaults and we do salvage these RPGs, drills, common common grenades, all this stuff. We only really keep... I like the legendary grenades. They're honestly pretty good. And the pretty... And the common armor boxes we salvage, we don't need those. And we, But we do keep the epic and mythical ones to open. And we do also open up these skin boxes because we can go ahead and check. These skins are honestly all pretty decent. Last map, I had the Shadow Clone, and I'm pretty sure that is one of the best. So we're going to go ahead and try to go for one of those again. But I'm going to finish it up. I'm going to finish up opening all these crates and stuff and salvaging everything and i'll come back once i do and hopefully i'm gonna have some more mythical armor boxes so we get some pretty good stuff from that okay so we're done doing and we're done opening all the crates and salvaging and we did get 141 trill tokens which we're going to take let's go ahead and check the salvage shop see if we can buy one and yes we can so let's open up this hopefully we get a token armor and a legendary pants okay we do already have that which is kind of unfortunate that's kind of unlucky but we are going to just keep doing that salvaging trying to get some good token armor with the mythical and masterful rarities but now i'm gonna go ahead and enchant my pickaxe so we have 141 trillion tokens to spend we did unlock key finder uh, we still need to unlock xp finder which is actually a pretty good enchant to have so we might hold off on spending all of my tokens but let's just go ahead and put some into this uh let's go max out key finder and i think i'm gonna wrap things up there i'm gonna get some higher levels for my pickaxe in the next video but i'll see you in the next one peace out